not going to allow, period, this to sit there for any, for another 10 years like it has with nothing going on. Well, Your Honor, in, in fairness. You know, it's just like I told you, and I it didn't come out here to pontificate. Everybody in here knows me well enough anyway, uh, that I didn't come out here to pontificate. But I pull up in our truck, Josh and I, pull up in our truck when we did the inspection. I get out of the car, there's two condoms at my feet. Josh gets out of his side of the truck, and there's a hypodermic needle, a heroin needle, at his feet. That's the kind of stuff this attracts when it's sitting there undeveloped and unproductive. And, and, and putting plywood on the windows ain't going to solve the problem. What you did was nothing. I would have had URS on board already, getting plans put together, to have it redeveloped if in fact that was my intentions. But here we sit here, all, now we're into 2013, and with the exception of you going over and have some uh, trees removed and some tuck pointing done, we're no further along than we were eight, we nine years. We've got some demolition done. And well, you can say got, whatever you got, want, but we we sit, we're still sitting there with a big sty and an eyesore, and these folks back here, and you can nod your area yes, are sick and tired of it. So here's what we're going to do. You're going to come up with a, what I put here, if you do not understand this, or Rob doesn't understand it, Tell me now, because when you come back and it ain't there, this place is going bye-bye. Understood? Understood? Sure. All right.